Hello everyone, welcome in Crochet Life and Stuff with Deborah. And yes, it is time for the return of snacks around the world. Let's try something new, shall we? Uh, this is, comes from a subscription box that I pay for with my own cashew munch. This is from the Munch Attic box. Uh, not sponsored, although if they wanted to, you know, I'm definitely open to that. You get a selection of snacks every month or so, if that's how you choose to order it. And uh, it's a whole bunch of good stuff. Now, I'm just going to pick three random things out of here. We're going to try them, talk about where they come from, and see if they're Fat Chick approved. I mean, come on. I'm picking this because it looks like some kind of a chip or a crisp kind of deal. They actually look more like Fritos looking at the picture, but a different color. I don't know what they are, actually. There's no English on this that I could see, except for that it contains wheat, peanut, and milk. Looks Korean. Let's see what the handy-dandy uh, snack doodah thing here says. Ah! King Conch. Conch-shaped corn snacks that are mixed with sweet, salty peanut butter. What? All right, I'm confused. Let's just get out the scissors because we know it's going to be devil proof packaging. I smell peanut butter. Okay, then. Oh, they look really cool. They're kind of shiny. They have a glisten to them. And yeah, they are kind of shell shaped. Look at that. All right, let's try one. Very crunchy. I was going to say, yeah, it's peanut with something else. There are sesame seeds in that sucker. Okay, then. They are definitely on the sweet side for peanut butter. Excuse me. But quite yummy. All right, I'm on board with that. I think that one's Fat Chick approved. It's a nice sweet peanut butter snack that's got a really good crunch to it. I'd eat those just for the crunch, are you kidding me? All right, let's see what else we can find in here. Oh, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna like this one just by looking at it. Look at that. It says brownie choco chip cookie. Not chocolate chip, but choco chip. I'm pretty sure this is going to be Korea as well. It is. The Brunoir cookie. Soft cookie with brownie filled center from Korea. Recognize the writing on it. The uh, I can't read Korean, but I recognize that as that's Korean um, letters or whatever. Letters or words. All right. Using the skizzers. And it is a cookie, or as in a lot of places would call it, a biscuit. Ooh, I can smell the chocolate goodness inside. I'm feeling a little uh, oversold, though. Look at the picture. Look at how dark the chocolate is in that picture. And look at it. You don't eat chocolate. Oscar's down here. I mean, it's good. I think it'd be really nice with a glass of milk. Would I go out of my way to get these, knowing what they are now? No. I'd, I'd go for a Chips Ahoy or something instead for the chocolatiness. But it's not bad. Fat chick approved, but wouldn't go out looking for it. Those crunchy things, though? Yeah, yeah, I'm on board for that. I'm going to set this down. And we're going to go for one more. Oh, let's see. That looks way too big. All right. I'm looking through because I'm not sure exactly what I want. How about... Oh, yes. Okay. Cookie cream cake, it says. Okay, it's an all Korea episode, y'all. We have been to Korea today because this is from Korea as well. I didn't realize it because it is all in English. 
Ah, uh, there is some text back there that isn't, but it's all in English. And that is just Oscar playing with a box. All right. Avoiding the, ooh, the Deborah can't open this syndrome. I gotta show you here. It looks for all the world like a little Debbie snack cake. Tell me it doesn't, come on. Part of it stuck to the package inside, but that's okay. It smells like a Little Debbie snack cake. It does. Hmm. I think I need a big glass of milk. Definitely not bad. The cake part is not as sweet as Little Debbie snack cake, but it's good. I think the fact that it's not as sweet is a good thing. Because usually those are just over sweet, like cloyingly sweet. Not bad. Would definitely make a nice little snack, like I said, with a glass of milk or maybe a cup of tea or a cup of coffee, whatever it is that you like to have. One of these would definitely do the trick. Hmm. My favorite out of the three today, though, this right here. Oh, my God. These little crunchy peanut butter things, they are the bomb. I know the kids don't say that anymore. I don't care because these are yummy. Mm -mm -mm. Have you tried anything new lately? Come on, be honest. Be it from Korea or any place else around the world or even from your own backyard, just some new stuff. Don't be afraid to try new things. It's always lots of fun because there's a little tag that flies up at the beginning of my video that says, curiosity is life. That was a fortune cookie that I actually got. And I took a picture of it. That's a picture of a fortune cookie that I got. Yes, I know fortune cookies are totally an American invention, uh, invented by, you know, Chinese Americans. So whatever, but they're fun. Especially when it says something cool like that. Curiosity is life. <laughs> Thank you for coming by. Thank you for being patient with me. I know we've missed a few weeks, but we're back on the snack wagon again um, with snacks around the world. Thank you so much, and I will see you very, very soon. Bye, y'all.